What's up, my dear boys and girls, it's your Ranger Boy here, and welcome to a discussion video. Man, I haven't done these kind of videos in a <clears throat> long while. <laughs> but really, bad jokes aside, because I want to talk about something I'm actually not joking about. In all honesty, Sun and Moon actually is quite good now. Like, really, for the last few weeks, this anime really is on a run. Some major things happening for the Sun and Moon gang, for example, new Pokemon, evolutions, and proper character progression. But now I want to ask this to you, my dear boys and girls, is Sun and Moon finally showing its full potential, and if so, why so late? Because honestly, I don't really understand. If you look at everything what the Sun and Moon gang has achieved within the last few weeks, everything they do right now could have theoretically been done months ago. Kiawa earning a new Z-move and finally letting his Charizard shine instead of just using it solely for transportation. Marlo finally doing what she aimed for, aka learning and gathering new recipes for her menu. She stated that in episode 18 and since then never ever once even made an effort to do so. Sophie is finally evolving his charger bug and hopefully his vicar world now will display some kind of character because as of now charger bug might be the most uninteresting pokemon in anime history i don't know anything about that pokemon and unlike pokemon like for example boldor or palpitoad it didn't battle enough to earn any kind of recognition the only character i'm actually a little bit okay with is lana since her progression was rather steady she gained her z ring few episodes later earned a z crystal then with the help of her master ia she had to train to master the z move and then stagnate out of nowhere, stagnation, until episode 99, where she finally progressed further with her catching Eevee, and then few episodes later, her Poplio evolved and she gained the Primarium Z, which leaves the door wide open for her future story. And the crazy thing within all of this is that now, now, they not only drastically reduced the funny faces, like seriously, in the last like 5 episodes, we had like 4 till 5 funny faces per episode. That is unusually low for a Sun and Moon episode. But they also let Lily step down from the spotlight as well. Do you guys realize that within the whole Pony Island arc, Lily didn't do anything meaningful? Even though this is a school project and therefore the focus should be on every member? But despite all that, they gave her the task to research Pokemon. Tracy style. And you know what? I'm okay with that. Honestly, that's the right move to do. But the main question again is, why did it take so long? Everything the gang just did recently, they could have done that during the Aether arc or even the Necrozma arc. Man, the Necrozma arc really lacked some major hype. Another prime example is that next week we are going to meet Marlo's dead mom. Marlo's dead mom? Really? Now you're mentioning Marlo's dead mom? Which could have been mentioned like months ago, maybe during her childhood flashback or maybe during the conflict with her dad, something like that. They never ever mentioned Marlo's dead mom. Never. And now they are doing it? Like the timing is so odd. Normally I would offer you some kind of explanation in my discussion of why this is happening the way it is. But I just can't. Because I'm just speechless. The thing they are doing with the Sun and Moon anime right now is some great stuff. And again, I'm not kidding. Since episode 91, I'm actually enjoying Sun and Moon a lot. And since episode 91, it got better and better with the exception of the Misty episode, which honestly, it really wasn't good. And especially if you're like me and you're actually caring about the development of the other characters. But the timing is again so odd because the anime is nearly ending and, and now they're stepping up their game when it comes to character progression. So yeah, that's basically my video. Please tell me, do you guys have any explanation of why Sun and Moon seems to improve now? Like, why this odd timing? I can't wait to see your explanation and therefore, I can't wait to see you guys in the comments down below.